we on Boss Talk 101. Yeah, we gon' talk. Sit here and go on camera and despise and do certain things that individuals do or even himself or certain individuals like, all right, me and him, we cool. We we cool. This, we linked up. We cool. So we talking off camera. We chill. But now soon the cameras roll. Like when I just said earlier, when the camera came on, when he said the word cuz, I thought he said cuz. I wasn't doing this shit for camera. He did. He didn't. <laughs> <laughs> Listen, man, I ain't said no motherfucking shit like that. Respect to all my right, people. Yeah, like, man, I don't know why he brought this shit up on the right, right, so, 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 I'm going to be honest with you. I ain't said no motherfucking cuz. As, as a non-member of anything, my, no, my, but, my whole deal is to help the children. Bro, if, if, Period. If, 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 he done did it again. He got the moment. Listen, listen, man. He got the moment. You got to take... In order... We mean, we all three men. Right. And we sitting here, we exchange the dialogues. Yeah. We all three from different walks of life, but Correct. we pushing the same narrative, bro. We trying to push the same line. Say these fucking babies, man. Say the kids. That's what it Fuck is. Fuck all you old niggas. You niggas That's who did 30 years in the yeah. How many niggas you kill? I don't give a shit, man. Neither. I don't care neither, man. Let me so ask. Whole, let me oh, ask. Okay, go ahead, go ahead, fam. So my whole thing is, I was, I was making a point. When the show started, I wasn't trying to be clowning, but and I didn't even know my nigga. That was that's that's fam. Then that's yeah. we, we salute. So you know what I mean. So I definitely didn't mean that in that aspect. It was just me coming from where I come from and just how serious that culture is. So I was just basically I was in my check standpoint where I was gonna just give it to him in a sophisticated way. Hey, look, I mean I don't do the cuss thing. We can be on his mic and talk all I that. I cannot but, believe this shit is on tape. This, 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 this shit is finna be discussed. They finna be like, yeah, no, well, I, no, I'm gonna no, say this. Like, yeah, I, I, I ain't no Nino Cappuccino. I, 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 I can be real with you. You know, to me, being from the outside looking in, you know, that's my spot right there where yeah. I come in with it. Uh, it when a LA, uh, a person from LA, my cousins being from LA as well, come to Texas and see somebody saying they some type of gang affiliated, it's not the same. It's not the same. To, I'm being real. I, I feel like they look at it as a different whole scenario because they're not from those hoods that that the people are. My cousins are from mm -hmm. and they've been coming down here ever since I was, and I'm old now. So when you say it's not the same, what do you mean? Meaning they didn't give them the same respect. I'm telling Who? you, my cousins when they right. came from L.A. Right. to down here, and we would go to Shreveport. Because this was they, a long time ago. Because now. they looked at it as generic. They 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 mimicking their lady. They mimicking exactly. us. Exactly. I'm telling uh -oh, you. And so so, so so when I when I seen you say that time, to, to LD, I like that. I'm like, oh, here we go. So no, it was, it's, that's that, a, that, okay. That, that, I'm that, just that, being real. First that's of all, the way I looked this at is going it. Bad. For, 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 it ain't going bad, LD. First of all, I don't have no knowledge of where this brother's yeah. from, what hood, what block. I'm from 300 block from Davis Street. Okay, see, yeah. I didn't know that. So that couldn't have been the, the case at all. Feel me? It was just something that I thought, oh, here go one of these country niggas again finna See? say the word to me. Oh, my <laughs> God. <laughs> I'm telling you. What you niggas want me to do, man? I'm going to tell you the truth. I'm going to speak uncut, man. I know. That's what I'm telling you. I can't say it. I exactly felt that way. I wasn't going to say it from anger, like, oh, man, I'm going to tear this motherfucker up. No, no, no. I knew where he was coming from. I was letting him know in a polite way. You knew where he was coming from. I knew it. I knew he was. No, when he said it, not that you said anything, but I knew where he was coming from because I'm thinking, oh, yeah, they feel like we just down here really just. Doing anything with the with okay, the whole fam, culture? On, no, on, man. On, on I got, that, let me on, tell you on, something. On that I right got there. cousins slash relatives right. from Texas, Kansas City, different walks of life, and they say the word. I don't let them say it to me, man. You shouldn't. I got it. Where, you where you because should. of where I fucking come from, what I have designed in my life in the past, the yeah. seeds I have planted. I'm a real one, man. Yeah. I'm a real fucking blood, man. Yeah. And wow. I don't let real crips. Cuz me. Can't, the, the biggest, baddest crip nigga can be on here right now with me and him change the dollar. And that nigga ain't cousin me. Or we will tear this motherfucker up. Hey, and that's what yeah. we supposed to do. But yeah. fam, you, you got the wrong it? guy. That's the wrong energy for Andy, though. It wasn't about that. Yeah. yeah. It was you know just, I feel you, though. I understand. Me? It was but just, let me I was going to lace you, you in a sophisticated yeah. business matter. Because I'm on right. both right. talk. One on one. And it's a family thing. One on one. By self, one on one. Right. And then I just met my brother. So it's like, I ain't going to go hard in the panel on this boy. He don't know better. If you don't Blood. know, <laughs> let me let me take let me grab this motherfucking mic right quick though because I can't. I, I didn't three hundred. You done, in you, the you, building, you know what I'm saying? All right, I, I got this two. This is good but stuff. But let me let me but tell you, hell over yeah, him. because he he. I'm talking about this. About, it's four five clips of just that. I thought he said, and this shit's gonna be all over. Let the record, let the let the camera zoom in. Listen, Anybody TV, in here that got, got, I got that yeah, part. make the, make sure TV that it's, land. Listen, TV land. Ab did not say that. Did not say no shit like that. Homie 
yeah, BB man, I just meet him, and he's good people from this point yeah. on. Straight up, whoop, whoop. Yeah. The homie, uh, listen, I came on, <laughs> and I thought, I heard something. I missed his school. Yeah. That was my ear. Yeah. And it wasn't going to be nothing negative. I was yeah. just going to let him know in a smooth manner. Hey, um, we, no, we not going to do that on Boston no, 101. We don't have to say, do that. Yeah, yeah, that ain't, ain't got to be you done. Feel me? But I want to yeah. ask you that while we on that. Okay, you from Nick. All right. What's your opinion or what? How? what's your view? What's your perspective on gang representation in particular? Uh, bounty hunter representation in Texas? Yeah. Hold up, hold up. I ain't through. Gang, gang representation, not only the negative aspects, because it's not all just negative. What's your take on how things, and let me, I'm gonna give you this little backstory. So he called me and tell me, I think because of our mutual understanding about our mutual understanding about whatever it is we represent. Cool. He wanted me to come in, right? So let me tell you just a little bit of how this shit work. All right. So he say, Al, I want you to come in, sit in with me. We'll talk to Nino Cappuccino, da, 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 BJ the Bonnie Hunter. So I look up and I start going through my thing to see, oh, and I see you here fuck with Spliff, Spliff. You know, we done, we done been communicating before. I right. so what has to happen is I call my homies from Stop Six. You know, I live in Austin. I'm in Austin, mm -hmm. so I call my homies from Stop Six. Well, my ace partner, Lil D, um, Suwo. You mm -hmm. know what I'm saying? That's his name. Like they calling this. So I I call him and let him know. Hey, I'm finna do this here on Saturday with Nino. Woo. Oh yeah, he and he finna be in the who. This is the way the politics go behind the scenes. Right, exactly. Let me know that, yeah, he tapped in and he and he finna be in the hood, yeah, he right? he did all your due diligence. Right, I'm doing what I'm supposed to. to do. Right, so when he's saying that, I'm like, all right, so bam. So we get to right here, okay, and then I looked, I followed you, I went into your what's the name, I see, okay, he on Truman right now, he with Evil and the rest of the guys, okay. Okay, that's a pipeline, is what I'm saying. And that's, that's so what I'm saying to you is, what do you think? About how it go I don't know how much you done I don't know what you done You know I, You with the fan I gotta say this on camera Fort Worth Fort Worth Is the elite of game banging in Texas That's, I know that yeah, I'm pretty sure you do yeah. So Everything really can't That umbrella right there And the way they put it down And we already know Blood is a defensive position So when you When you see that Our Brothers up there That have stood that test of time throughout this time, they like, you know, infallible to people like me. You know what I'm saying? So when they say something or whatever, you know, I'm like, uh, you know, whatever. Okay, so what do you think? What's your perspective? Now, I'm only on one side of the line. Y'all already done accused me of some bullshit. <laughs> so I can't speak on the other, I, I can't speak on the other side, but I want to say this. Okay, this. What do you think about how this shit go down here? All right, check this out. This is straight me out right here with us, dear, man. Yeah. This is straight us out. First and foremost, <laughs> shout out to Truman Street, Stop Motherfucker 6, Big E, Hitman acting, Benny Boy, man, what's up with it, Benny? What's up, man, to them hitters out there, man? Big Trent, man, all the rest of the guys, man. I, hey, listen, man. I as have, well as the whole East Side, Eastwood. The whole Eastwood. Everybody. Every, listen, yeah. man, we've we been through that some guy, man. I, listen, I've been through the root of it, man, and yeah. I've seen it, i felt it, i smelt it. And my reason, personally, for touching down, and I said I made it my business, I reached out to these cats. Nobody called me, no nothing. I reached out to certain dudes, me and my team, and I told them, hey man, I, I need to connect with these brothers. And my reason being is, it wasn't to glorify them as being bloods, but me connected from where I'm connected from and us understanding the fact that, all right, when Texas got a hold to this, this gang culture, mm -hmm. Texas really took our shit and they took our shit in mannerism what they understood and they took and they built on protocol based on what they seen from the West. So we respected it, feel me? In the very beginning, before the, when the drug center was what I was talking about, when I talked about country niggas and I said how they say certain words. <laughs> we just looked at them, they were like, like, like you were saying, your cousins come down, generic. But once dudes from LA who were official start crossing those barriers, cause I was one of them, and we start coming in the early 80s and we was bringing the D-boy game slash the banging game with us this is how the seeds were planted. Yeah, we on Boss Talk 101. 101. Yeah, we gonna talk.